Hey, did you do the homework last night? What? We had homework? You mean you didn't do it either? Uh-oh. Lewis, quick, did you do last night's homework? Of course I did. Why? We didn't do it. Well, you can't copy my answers. I've already got them from someone else, and it's bad luck to copy copy work. Says who? Uncle John's bathroom reader? Oh man. Myron, what are we gonna do? Hmm. Let's skip school to do it. What? That's a bit overreacting. Oh really? Well, let me remind you that this is the sixth time we haven't done our homework in a row. I don't think we can slide by again. It's time for action. Well, I don't know. Andy, for once in our life, we must do our homework. You know, if you had that kind of attitude yesterday, you wouldn't be in this mess. Can it, emo boy? I'm not emo. My hair just curves this way by itself. Okay. Emo boy. Come on, Andy, let's go. Have fun at school. So, you ready? No, but we have to do this. Okay, let's go. Break time? Break time. Okay, now let's work. Break time. Okay, class. Today we will start our group projects. Everyone must find a partner or go. Oh no. <laughs> Looks like you're stuck with me, emo kid. Okay, first of all, I'm not emo. Second of all, I don't have to be stuck with you. There are plenty of other people around here. Well, yeah, just look around. You're the only one without a partner. And I'm the other one who doesn't have a partner. Shut up. Oh man, Myron, this is the life. Yeah, you said it, Andy. Ugh, uh, man, Lewis is sitting in school doing who knows what, and we're just chilling out having a good time. Yeah, having a good time. Well, not really, uh, just harnessing the raw power of microwaves. Um, actually, we've been watching TV for the last four hours. Well, duh, I did say good time, so... Emphasis on the good time. Okay. Okay, emo kid. Let's get something clear. Just because we're partners doesn't mean I have to work with you. Um. Oh. Well, okay. Just uh. Because we just have to start working. Oh no! I don't have to start working. You have to start working. Look, we have to work together at some point, so we might as well try and get along. Oh, well, look who's Mr. Peacemaker. Don't make me beat you up, emo kid. Oh, wait, stop calling me emo, because I'm not emo. Sure you are, just look at your wrists, they're all cut. That's from my cat. Oh, sure, that's what all emos say. Ugh. What... what time is it? Andy, you're awake! Good. Myron, you're still here? 
Did we miss school? You bet we did. It's a new day, Andy. We actually did it. We played hooky. Oh, crap, man. Hey, doofuses. Enjoy skipping school yesterday? Yeah, man. Enjoy not skipping school yesterday? No. I got a black eye from that dumb kid with the crazy widow's peak. Ah, oh, that sucks. Yeah, it's whatever, though. Here. Thought I'd bring you guys the assignments from today. Thanks, Lewis. We won't be needing that, Lewis. What do you mean? Don't you want to catch up? You guys did finish yesterday's homework, right? Wasn't that the whole point of skipping school? Yes, yes, Lewis. It was the point. But things have changed. They have? They have! You see, yesterday was an eye-opening moment for me. We spent the entire day running around town, going to pizza places, arcades, old sheds, and despite having all that free time, we still didn't do the homework. What's your point, dude? I don't care. You don't care about what? The homework, school, all of it. I realized that yesterday I had more fun than I've ever had in my short 14-year-old life, and I don't want that to end. Okay, Myron, you're scaring me. You wouldn't understand, emo boy. To you, life is just a sad journey to the grave or whatever. But me, I finally see the joys life can bring. And if you ask me, school gets in the way of those joys. Okay, first off, stop saying I'm emo. I told you my hair lays this way by it. Myron, what are you saying? Guys, I'm dropping out of middle school. Dropping out of middle school? Myron, you're insane! Am I, Andy? Or am I the only sane person left in this world? Think about it, man. We only get a short amount of time in this world. Do you really want to spend it all in school learning things? Or do you want to get out there and live your life to the fullest? You're right, Myron. What? I think Myron's onto something. There's no reason for us to stay in school, and I think yesterday proved just that. I don't want to waste my time in school when I can be doing what I want. That's the spirit! You guys are crazy. Do you realize there are like a bajillion reasons why this won't go well? Yo, Lewis, we don't need your two cents, okay? Go eat lame somewhere else. Yeah, like school. Heyo! Ugh. What time is it? Andy, you're awake. Good. I found two cents. One for each of us. Ugh. How did it come to this, Andy? Someone thought it would be a good idea to drop out of school. Hey, don't pin this all on me. I didn't hear any complaints at the time. Ugh, you're right. I went along with it. But dude, what are we supposed to do now? Uh, keep begging for change? What else is there? Man, we can't just beg for handouts the rest of our life. 
Why not? Uh, because it's not gonna make us enough money to live? Ah, didn't think about that. Well, hey, how about we ask old Lewis to lend us some cash? <laughs> Isn't he loaded? Dude, don't you remember? Lewis killed himself. Oh, right. So, then what do we do? Well, to be honest, Myron, I've had some time to reflect on the last few years, and I've realized something. What's that, Andy? We were dumb kids. We really screwed up. And you know what? That makes me think there might be other dumb kids out there who make the same mistakes as us. Where are you going with this? We should go out and share our story to other kids. To brag? No, you idiot, not to brag. To help them avoid what happened to us. Wow, Andy. That's actually a really good idea. Let's do it. To the school. Okay, so the doors are all locked. It looks like we're gonna have to climb the back fence. All right. Ah, oh, nice, a pep rally. We'll have an audience. That's a lot of people though. How about a drink to calm your nerves? Welcome, Welcome everyone, everyone to the, the spring, spring pep rally. rally. Now, now, first, first off, off, I'd just, just like, like to, to say... say... Hold on! Stop the presses! What, what on earth? <laughs> Listen up, kids. We've, We've got, got some, some life, life lessons, lessons to school you on. You may be asking yourselves, who are these two guys who just crashed a middle school pep rally? Well, we'll tell you, we were once like you, but cooler! And back then, we made some mistakes. Some big mistakes. And now, here we are. We're homeless, addicted to drugs, begging for change on the street. It sucks hard, dudes! Yeah, so please, if anyone out there is thinking of dropping out of middle school, take our advice. Don't. It's not worth it. We were young and stupid. Now we're old and stupid because we dropped out. Don't be like us. Take our words to heart and stay in school. Better yourselves. Make some friends. Respect your teachers. Right now, you're on a path to bright futures. And you just have to stick with it. You see, we fell from the path, and now we're paying for it. It's probably too late for us but there's still some hope for you. So please, don't be like us. Be smart. Be dedicated. Be determined. Because at the end of the day, I'm just a kid. Life is a nightmare. I'm just a kid, and I know that it's not fair. Nobody cares, cause I'm alone in the world. Security, get these idiots out of here. Whoa, whoa, boyos, hands off. All right, you idiots, you've got a visitor. Oh man, I hope whoever it is brought bail money. <laughs> Lewis? Jeez, you guys look worse up close. Lewis, what are you doing here? We thought you killed yourself. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? Why? Because, dude, you're an emo. Isn't that what emos do? What? No. I told you guys, I'm not and I never have been. Oh, whatever. Look. I came to see you guys because I wanted to help. Really? Yeah. I heard about your little guest appearance at the middle school pep rally, and I had to come see if it was true. Turns out you guys are way worse off than I thought. Here. This is my card. I've got some connections that might be able to get you out of this mess. 
Give me a call when you can. You know, it's not too late for you guys. Wow. Yeah. What a freaking emo. Huh, <laughs> for real. Did you see that hair? I know, right? Dude, I smuggled in some alcohol. Want some?